Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Renaissance Marie Austin, and I just wanted to come to you with a very quick review of a new fragrance that I purchased. Um, I don't know if you guys know, but this may be very new, especially for this channel, but I am a huge Billie Eilish fan. I have been since 2018, and today I'm going to talk about her new fragrance, which is called Eilish. Now, let me give you a little bit of background of me and how I am with fragrance. Okay, so I do not go to the department store and buy fragrance. I normally purchase like Caribbean or Jam uh, Jamaican roll-ons, um, but I'm not even super diehard about that. I would say like many, many, many years ago, I was um, at this store in my old neighborhood and they used to sell fragrances there, like the, the roll-ons for like $5. And there was this one that just blew me away. It was called Raspberry. I think it's called Fruit Punch now. But for those of you that are familiar with roll-ons, like the ones that range in the Fruit Punch, or the raspberry or the cherry flavors like the red ones you'll know what I'm talking about so for about five years I wore this roll-on called raspberry until I could no longer find it one day a friend of mine came to my office uh, last year and she had like hand sanitizer and the smell I knew exactly what it was I said girl I need that I need that smell I've been looking for that smell for years and come to find out one of our friends who makes the oils um, and sells the roll-ons had the smell that I have been looking for for ages I know a lot of people go to Bath and Body Works and I know that fragrances like vanilla brown sugar and vanilla are really popular fragrances but because I have a chemical in imbalance and especially after my surgery there are a lot of smells um, even with foods that make me nauseous and even with colors like for instance an all white room and all cream room makes me very nauseous whether I'm standing in it or whether I'm looking at it in a magazine I tend to stay away from anything vanilla, anything brown sugar. Um, my number one um, notes that really work for me are citruses. And the number one is grapefruit. That one of my favorite lotions is by Nest and it is the grapefruit um, uh, fragrance. Nest also has some roll-ons that are pretty unique and I would say maybe a couple of Christmases ago, um, I went to Sephora and they were having a sale on this one fragrance that's very hard to get, but it had a cocoa note, like a woodsy sandalwood with cocoa. And I really love unique fragrances that are woodsy and green and evergreens. So with that being said, let me talk about Eilish. <laughs> so... The bottle is really, really beautiful. The bronziness is really beautiful. I have already sprayed some on, but I will spray it a little bit more on, and it smells good. Okay, so when she first started promoting this online, I was a little leery about, you know, the whole vanilla note, but then when I saw the other notes that um, were added to this formula, like um, other woodsy, woodsy notes I was like okay because I've had sprouts in the essential <laughs> oil section trying to buy stuff and mix my own stuff and I know that like vanilla can tend to be like very sweet right so when I know something is sweet I tend to cut it with something woodsy like a sandalwood or a cedar wood or a rosemary like grapefruit and rosemary is really nice together so when once i finally purchased this and then when it finally came um when i opened the box and i took the top off first thing i did was smell into the top 
and it's not now, but fresh, fresh out the box, when I smelled into it to the top, it was like a strong whiff of vanilla. Not that it smelled bad and it didn't make me nauseous, but I was like, whoa, like, like the vanilla for me, I feel like is the, the scent, like the residual scent. It's like the foundation um, and it's like the lingering scent that just happens to be there whether you spray this or not. But then when you spray it, so I'm gonna spray a little on my wrist. Let me let the alcohol die out. The vanilla tends to disappear and all of the other notes come out. Oh shoot, the box is over there, duh. Okay, but nonetheless, you can go onto her website the ingredients are there. She explains the notes. Everything is there. Oh, it's really good. It's really good. Now for me, just on the smell alone, as it's like fully dried, like at the end of it, I get like the word pun pungent comes to mind and not like a nasty pungent, like a must, which, you know, human smells i i don't think my smells bad <laughs> my semen smells bad i know some people say but i don't think it smells bad <laughs> um so on the end note what i get that's left is it's something that's like pungent like a citrusy note Ugh, i love it i love it oh yeah so another thing that i like is in um, Billy's uh, promo commercial, she explained that even the color, I know you could say, she's like, it's not really clear. Like the color is that bronzy color. So I noticed, as you can see, see how my skin is like glistening. I've sprayed this all over my chest and I almost feel like in a sense, it's like a body spray but I tend to usually spray my arms around my chest and then my other arm. This, like, and my wrist. So this, all of this, this, and this is where I tend to focus because I do love that shine that comes out. Now, call me a novice because, like I said, I don't buy fragrances and I don't really know what fragrances do. But I love the fact that... Ooh, that's so pretty. I do rub it all in so that it's even and that it's not like blotchy. I specifically wore my, uh, <laughs> well, actually, I'm just fresh out the shower, fresh faced, fresh hair wash, fresh. I'm finally out of braids now, so I look like a little girl again. Oh, but look at that. Oh my gosh. It just makes such a beautiful sheen all over the skin that is like so pretty. And another thing is like, it's very warming. So when you spray this on, there's something so warming about it that makes you feel relaxed. Like I just rubbed it in, it's warming. And so I feel relaxed after I spray it. Let me do some more on this side. <laughs> so I'm not uneven. Okay, I just sprayed again. Okay. So, there's a snap and it's on. So, that's Eilish. Really pretty bottle. The smell is nice. I'm really happy with it. So, if you're interested in the Eilish fragrance, it's going to be restocked Monday. That is tomorrow, um, 9 a.m. West Coast time or uh, Pacific time. So, Yep, I'm not getting paid for this. <laughs> so just letting you know that I really like it. And I love how pretty it makes the skin looks. And I love the sheen. And I love the smell. And it does last for quite a long time. Somebody said 12 hours, but I don't know. I think it depends on the person. I would say it probably lasts like four, five, six. Probably no more than six hours. Once on and the alcohol dries and the citrus comes out. It is very soft. And I was at my sister's house over Thanksgiving. Um, 
and I came back and I could still smell it in the room. But when I walked in my room, it the vanilla is what permeates. I feel like the vanilla is foundational and it's residual. So you guys, this is Eilish. Enjoy. Okay. Bye.